was I supposed to know he couldn't swim? He's the swim coach. It's literally in the name, swim and coach. It doesn't matter. That behavior is unacceptable. You're on academic probation. What? No class and no swimming a month. No swimming? School's almost out. The last meet is on Friday. I have to go. You should have thought of that before you tried to kill one of our staff members. I didn't try to kill him. It was an accident. Why is everybody saying that? Ah, he was fine. as fine as a man on a respirator can be. It's not my fault he lied about being able to swim. There are no negotiations here, Mr. Mora. And no class? What's the point of that? Keeping you away from other students gives us the chance to clean up the mess that you made. It's so pointless. It's like when you guys give us Saturday school and all we can do is just sit there. You can't even do homework. <laughs> ah, don't worry about that. You'll be working. I expect all of the floors cleaned before and after all of your peers' classes. What do you, what do you see when you look at our mascot, Teresa? I don't know, something I would rather be somewhere else. You know what I see? I see poise. Elegance, dignity, honor, and strength. All the things that, in, that make us embody here at St. Joshua's Academy. I think, I think you could learn a thing or two from her. Mm -hmm. Come in. Mrs. Bishop? Yes. Rayleigh's mother is here for you. Oh, please bring her in. Mrs. Mora, thank you. Thank you of for course, coming. Of course, of course, of um, course. It's not like I have patients waiting in the office to be seen. Uh, uh, Rayleigh, would you um, excuse us for a moment? Uh, your mother and I need to talk. Mrs. Mora, please. No, it's fine, I'll stand. Mrs. Mora, your son's behavior has been... His behavior? You call me up in here to talk about his behavior? <laughs> Mrs. Mora. You call me here to talk about his behavior? My son is an A student. He's passing his classes. He's one of the best on the swim team, while the other students are sitting on their behinds, and you call me here to talk about his behavior? Mm -hmm, Mrs. Mora. You know, no, I, I'm so tired of this nonsense. Look. It's not nonsense in the classroom. There is a man's life at risk. And if he continues to disregard the rules and the examples that we set here at St. Joshua's, then I think it might be time for you to find another campus. Mrs. Mora, he's, he's a really good student and he's a, a phenomenal athlete, but I, I understand. I understand. I'll talk to him. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you, Thank Mrs. Mora. Thank you. Thank you. You too. Have a great day. Thank you. You too. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. I don't know, Teresa. What do you think? Listen to the stereo tonight, tonight, tonight. Head falls. Not a she want the more. Let's play again. Yeah, yeah. Listen to the stereo tonight, tonight, tonight. Hey, hey. No way, where he go? Listen to the stereo tonight. Let's do it again. Bro, who's not going to class today? Uh, yes.
Mom! 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 Ray! I don't know. This guy's tripping again. No, it'd be bro. Mom! Mommy! What, really? What? I'm... I'm sorry. I'm so sorry doesn't fix everything. I'm tired of coming down here. Every time I come down here for this school, it's some nonsense, some foolishness. This time you push the swim coach in the pool. What kind of swim coach can't swim? That, that's what I said. It doesn't make any sense. What? You tried to kill somebody? I, you tried to swim coach? I didn't try to. I didn't try to kill him. It was. It was a harmless joke, and I pushed him in the water. And well, I. He can swim. I didn't think he could. I didn't think he couldn't. But he's a swim coach. Why can't he swim? I, that's what I'm saying. The whole situation is stupid. Yeah, but what, you gotta be the class clown? Why is this always, you always in trouble? It's not always, it's just... I think that music is getting to your head. It's not the music. So why am I always down here with some foolish? You know how these people look at us? You know how they look at you? Why have I, why I have to come down here all the time because you can't behave? I have to leave work, drive three hours to come down here? I don't know why they told you to come. They could have just called you. I... Somebody is injured because of your foolishness. It wasn't supposed to get like that. I don't know, things just got out of hand. Well, now it's not funny anymore. I expect better from you. I don't want to have to come down here again for this nonsense. Yes, ma'am. Do you understand me? You know, if your father was here, it would have been a different situation. Yes, ma'am. What's going to happen now? I don't know. I can't go back to class. They put me on probation. Well, then you have to sit out your probation until it's time for you to go to class. By the time probation's over, everybody's going to be graduated by then. Then you just come home. That'll be the end of it. Do you understand each other? Yes, ma'am. Okay, I got to go back to work. All right? Yes, ma'am. So I expect you to be on your best behavior. Okay? Yes, ma'am. All right. Okay, don't let me have to come back up here. You won't. All right, good. How's Hollow doing? <sighs> She's good. She's good. Okay. All right. Love you. Love you too, Mom. Ah. What's wrong? Ah. What's wrong with you? My nose. Are you still getting nosebleeds? Yeah. Okay, here. Ah. I do with this. Here. Ah. Okay. It's all my shoes. Dang. It's all right. You'll be all right. Yes, ma'am. Okay? I gotta go back to work. Okay. All right. Bye-bye. Right. Bye, Mom. Love you. Love you, too. Swim coach that can't swim. I miss them nosebleeds, mama always said to slow down I miss them nosebleeds, dad saying it's only a drown I miss them nosebleeds I miss them nosebleeds I miss them nosebleeds, what I knew nothing about I miss them nosebleeds, now I gotta figure it out I miss them nosebleeds I miss them nosebleeds Thinking back when the youngin' was a kid There was one thing that I always really did Hated them at the time and they never let me be, yeah I used to get really bad nosebleeds They'd always make me late, force me to shower School nurse's office, each and every hour I used to hate those fucking nosebleeds, yeah And I ain't talking about shitty seeds, yeah This is before I was scared of police When I was tying red ribbons all around trees Before I got my heart broken each and every week When I would get beat for not saying please. I wish they'd stop, but they just kept coming. Try to keep my head up, but the blood kept running. Try to keep my head up, but the blood kept falling. Those are simple days, still had a smile on my face. And now I'm trying to get dreads on my head like my dad had them. Just trying to shake all these shorties like a bad habit. Been on my life, just call me the black gamby. Before I ever had dreams of me living lavish. 832 is the area code. 713 on my mama phone. 281, my daddy ain't home, my daddy ain't home, my daddy ain't home Dad saying, if I cook, little boys, you better eat it Skinny little niggas, say you know you fucking need it Yeah, 
yeah, we from the islands. First generation Wylon. Five boys like Dylon, 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 Dylon. I miss the nose blades, mama always had to slow down. I miss the nose blades, dad saying, so me, you drown. I miss the nose blades. I miss the nose blades. I miss the nose blades, not a shit, really, must suck. I miss the nose blades, miss, not giving a fuck. I miss the nose blades. I miss the nose blades. I was at was always on some shit It was so serious Who you broke your bread with White kids looked down on me Cause I wasn't fucking rich Black kids said I wasn't cool So I couldn't fit Too black for the white kids Too white for the black kids How I'm in the middle But still couldn't fit in My parents religious Had so many damn kids Couldn't keep track Now I'm at a Catholic prison Only a few black kids on the scene Everybody watches to see us bleed Wait and see They plotting on a downfall When I wanna get the good grades Good love and degree But I'm I'm about to do it better than my mom and dad did it I'm about to shake all these women and these bad bitches Been speaking my mind to whoever gon' listen Been speaking my mind to whoever gon' listen Looking at the past like I'm looking at a mirror The color's getting darker but my focus getting clearer I guess and that's what happens when a kid gets older Yeah, the days get shorter and the nights get colder Huh Speaking to the Lord, Rayleigh? <sighs> no. And even if I was, she probably wouldn't respond. What's up, Jennifer? So then, what you doing? <sighs> More like taking a break. A break from what? It's not like you've been studying. I haven't seen you in class. Are you just saying fuck it So graduation? I'm on probation. I would say fuck it if I could, but I can't. I don't have a choice. I knew it. You know, I was hoping that I wasn't right this time. Because being on probation, right before you're about to graduate, it's like the worst situation a student could be in. I can just feel your sadness. But if it'll make you feel better, I was on probation last month. Well, I guess if it makes you feel any better, I should be done by the end of this week. That is, if I don't fuck up again, it's great because I can enjoy the next week without having to worry about anything. You know, school will be pretty much over and I'm looking forward to it. I mean, same. I'm just gonna enjoy my time here relax, and try to stick it out till you graduate, you know? Ugh. So you like being here? Better than home. <laughs> <laughs> I feel it. So, when was the last time I, I saw you? Do you remember Maria's party? Oh shit, it's been a minute. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was, it was fun, it was cool. It was okay. Yeah, until you <laughs> disappeared. I disappeared? Yeah, you disappeared. We came together and then you just left, I guess. I don't know what you were doing. I mean, I invited you, but it's not like we were gonna be glued to each other all night. Okay, well, don't, it's, don't do all that. I, I don't expect you to be glued to me all night. It's more like, you know, it was your friend. So, you know, I'm around a bunch of people I don't know. So I'm expecting to hang out with you. So I just assumed that we would, I don't know, kick it together. I don't know. Next thing I knew, you were gone. <laughs> yeah, because it took so long to find you. I just ended up leaving. And, and that's when, that's when Harlow called me. Mm, right. All right. Okay, um, how are you and your girlfriend? Uh, we're good. 
We're good. She uh, she's supposed to do my hair tomorrow for the dance on Friday, so yeah. Right. Four years of our miserable, privileged lives are finally coming to a close. I know. Honestly, I, I didn't think it was going to take this long. Yeah? Yeah. Attention students, all tuition fees are due before graduation. Jesus didn't forget about you on the cross, so don't forget about his institution. Have a good day. The staff will not be missed. <laughs> Yeah, the staff's the whole reason why I'm even in this mess. <laughs> Cleaning floors, wiping tables, scrubbing the, scrubbing the toilets. Oh. It's disgusting. Gross. If I get kicked out right before we graduate, right before I get my certification, I'm gonna fucking lose it. That's the whole reason why I'm here. All cause you push the swim coach. <laughs> In the pool? You heard about that? Ray, my mom was the one that told me, dude. <sighs> I know. But everyone's talking about it. Why is everybody talking about it? Like, why is this like the, the, th the thing to talk about? But is it true that you just pushed him in the pool because you've been trying to get back at him for being an asshole all these years? That's what everybody's saying? Uh-huh. Is it true? I fucking hate this school. No, <laughs> it's not true. It was one of our last practices before our final meet. I said, fuck it. I'm like, why not? You know? Football players throw ice over their coaches. <laughs> and he's supposed to be like the, the Olympian that never made it and, and did all kinds of time trials and went to all kinds of junior Olympics. I push him in the pool. Turns out the nigga couldn't swim? <laughs> what kind of shit is that? How did he get this job? And I ended up missing the last meet, which sucked, you know? The meets are the best part about swimming. I don't give a fuck about being fast. <laughs> Honestly, I'm just glad dude's alive and I don't have to see him anymore, you know? Yeah, I don't know. I wouldn't stress about it, you know? I mean, they act like all-knowing, all-powerful, right? But in reality, they're just as weak and useless clueless just like all of us i mean look at your coach can't even swim but you know this already like i don't need to explain it all to you it's something i've definitely realized over the years you know they just did a really good job of fooling us and i'm ready to leave and and whatnot but i'm just not sure if I'm going to be able to be the person I'm supposed to be out there. We've been listening to these adults for so long. I just, I don't know. It just feels like it's going to be different on the other side, you know? Well, eventually things are going to have to change. You didn't think we were going to be here forever, did you? <sighs> not forever. I just, I just got used to the bullshit they've been feeding us. Saying to love thy neighbor, but willing to kick kids out as soon as their parents lose their jobs without giving them a second to get back on their feet? Remember the twins, Kiko and Mimi? Dude, I really miss them. Yeah, I miss them too. I couldn't even say bye. With the quickness. <laughs> when somebody's actually in need, when somebody actually needs help, where's the compassion? Where's the same shit that they be teaching in school? And ever since then, this place, it just, just feels so fake. And we've been here for so long, it just, you start to think, <laughs> is that what life's really like? Damn, I, I really think I'm starting to rub off on you. Don't feel special, you're not the only one that's been here for four years. <laughs> Okay, what the hell? So, is your nose bleeding? Yeah, I've been getting nosebleeds a lot more lately. Huh. I used to get them a lot as a kid, but you think it means anything? I don't know. Maybe you're just like stressed out. There's a lot going on right now. You're on probation. You're about to graduate. Swim coach. 
helps a lot. Yeah, I think you just gotta relax. Do you wanna smoke? I can't. Are you sure? Yeah, I'm, I mean, no, 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 I can't, I can't. If, if I get caught with that, I'm fucked. Thank you. I know what you should do, Rayleigh. You should, uh, you should, uh, go hang out with your girlfriend. She can make you feel better, right? I try to tell, he keeps smoking weed by the locker room and now we can't do it because he wanted, every time, no, every got caught. why would you do that? You're the one who still can't roll the punch, so I don't want to That has it. nothing to do with it. At least I don't smoke with a teacher. The fucking professors, bro, every time, every single time. It doesn't matter. Is did it, we get caught? Huh? Did we get caught? You did, I didn't get caught. You're the one who's about to get kicked out of school. What? You literally, oh, he's literally not worth it. Bro. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> bro, you know you deserve that shit, bro. <laughs> oh, fuck. You hit my mouth, bro. <laughs> it was... So, okay, so be real. Be real. No bullshit. No bullshit. No bullshit. What? Did y'all really try to kill the teacher? We didn't try to kill him! Bro, like, literally everybody fucking saying that. Dude. Dude. Yeah, I don't know, bro. <laughs> Press charges. You're lucky you're still here, Dude, they should they should press charges against him for even applying for the job. You can't do that. You can't. He really can't swim. You can't you're swim? Just, that one's fucked up. That's like that's like hiring like, that's like hiring a teacher who can't teach. Can't teach. Oh, and hey, that's like half a public school. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> that's I, I mean that's why we're here right now. That's seven in the morning, you can be whatever you want to be. No, that's a fact, it's a fact. Wait, hold on, hold on, hang on, let me get a picture of you real quick. This is nice, this is nice, hold on. That's a good one. You ready? Three, two, one. Awesome. All right, let's get the fuck out of here. Y'all ready? Let's do it. So how long you gonna have to be, like, like fucking cleaning the table with the mom? Bro, man, too long, man. It kind of it kinda hurts to see you do it, but it's also very funny. It's stupid because we're about to leave anyways. 